What's up guys, Celestra here again, back with a quick trophy guide. So, I was a bit confused about this one, so I'm just letting other people know, hopefully. This is the well-rounded trophy, so this is for getting all of your characters with all of their weapon abilities, and all of their limit breaks from the folios. So I initially did all this, as you can see, all the weapons are maxed out here. So when you've got the full page of the weapon, that means you've got every single weapon, and just make sure you've got all the bars to maximum, you've got all their abilities. But... Even if you get the limit breaks from the folios, it doesn't actually unlock. So I'm going to show you how it actually works. It's not just the limit breaks, it's everything else. So I'll show you which ones you need in order to actually unlock the trophy. Right then, when you get to one of these machines or when you go to one of the Magnata book places for the folios, you want to make sure you're getting all of these. So the synergy abilities and the ones that are purple. So that purple sword there or the purple swirl, they all count towards this trophy. And if you don't unlock these, you won't unlock the trophy. I didn't actually unlock a lot of these throughout the game because I, I didn't see the point. I was already strong enough to beat most things in the game. The abilities like that, which you just saw me unlock, and any of the synergy abilities slash attacks that you have, because I, I know there's synergy attacks and there's the actual one where you press R1 and press the button that way. But, you need to make sure you unlock these for every single character. If you need to reset, you can just reset your skills with square. So if you've put a lot of points into like the blue ones, which I didn't really bother with because it was only slight increase to your health or tiny bit of increase to like MP or something like that. You just need to make sure you unlock things like the snow flurry, things like this, which is hack and slash, so it's a synergy ability. As soon as you've done all that, including the one that is a limit break, because you get a limit break, I think it's level 8 or 9. It's one of the last things that you can get. It's a yellow one. So you'll see that at the very top of the board. That's one of the last things you'll get. So as you can see, top of the board here with Barrett, that yellow one is his second limit break. You only get one of those, but there's a lot of these abilities on the board. And once you've unlocked all those, you will unlock the trophy. Just doing the last couple on Yuffie here, and that will unlock me the trophy. So she has one more missing here. And there you go, well-rounded makes it a lot easier doing it this way. If you don't actually have enough points, just reset, like I said, and just put them into the ones that you need. And then if you want to change your character around, you can, but that's how you unlock the trophy. So a little bit of confusion when I tried to do this, but hopefully this has been helpful, guys. If it has, leave a like, share the video, have a look at some of my other trophy guides for FF7 Rebirth, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.